lying. <laughs> Bitch, why are you lying? It's like, this is like your vocals when they come in, they're mono, right? Oh, yeah, Crescendo. one channel. So it's like, it's a mono signal. This is stereo. Like music, argument, what? Me and T been like going back and forth heavily. Not back and forth, but just like discussing the like, nigga. The work is the work. Yeah. Like you could spend ten thousand on marketing, or you can go do ten thousand dollars worth of work. Yeah. Right. And it's like you can run as many ads as you want, but if you was to hit a nigga ten times with some. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a nigga got all the way to a couple million of just mm -hmm. you can't miss a nigga. I show up every day. <laughs> I show up every day. Sheesh. It's gonna work out. I hit that weed. That weed just relax me. <laughs> mm -hmm. Maybe that's what it is too. Like. That's what it is. You just, I'm a crack at it. No, nigga. No, that's not where I was going. Oh. You be up and ready to get active and do shit. And you're just like, this right. how you the is. And we like, hold on, nigga. Let's do this. Yeah. <laughs> Why are you saying? Because that's really that's how really it how be. be. Like, you would hit that button and be like, that's Ooh. really how it be. You could have been ready like, to go. Slow down. <laughs> I, think, I think that's like... That's it. I just be running at the speed of light when I need to just slow down. It's just a beat. Because beat. when you like, we make it. you realize it's infinite. So you're going to get there regardless. Oh my God. How you get there is up to you. And the condition that you're in when you get there is up to how you get there. And it's like, if you walk there, you gonna be cool. But if you run full speed for a brick wall every day on the way there, your head gonna hurt a little bit when you get there. I mean, you just gonna you can end your career like Floyd Mayweather or like Mike Tyson. Mm. And I think because <laughs> <laughs> Mike Tyson, they both successful as fuck. But they one is fucked up. Like both were fucked up though. That's the <laughs> yeah, thing to note. Like both were like. Okay. They hurt. Yeah, but they not hurt. They, they just me, like it's they short. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah. It's cool. You take some like punches. <laughs> they get a little different. <laughs> and that's the beauty of like hip hop and art and shit. It's like you ain't gotta take those. You feel me? You only take those that you give them to yourself. Remember, like, the. It's in your control. You know? Like, you could run when you able to run, but when you need to slow down, you just slow down. And if you're doing it right, it's like. There's nothing you could really miss. You know? It's like the day you you stop, mm. you start getting less. Oh, because you would need that for the monitor. Results. Yeah. And then when you start back, you start getting results again. But that never changes. So you just slow down for years and then decide, all right, I'm back. I'm going to get back now. And the results going to start reflecting the work. Oh, my mama, bro. Oh. <laughs> That's why I be smoking. Cause, <laughs> no, you don't be getting that when you're no, sober. Because my mind like literally moves too fast for me to even like exist sometimes. And it's just like idea, idea, mm -hmm. idea. And I'm just like, same, <laughs> nigga. Mm -hmm. so same. Just, like, can I help you hone in on one thing? We would have to put yep. two channel lines and put it together. For sure. Nigga, my mind be like, that's why I fish. And it just like, it makes me slow down and not like, Anticipate what I'm doing next. And you know, that's a great example because it's like, I 
guess it is though. I was about to say, there's no like marketing in fishing, but there is, right? There's things you could do to help you catch a fish faster, right? Six. Technically called mm-hmm. Depends. Depends. Yeah, I was gonna say, it's really a fish. You could go to a, to a, you could go to a spot that people yeah, historically they catch cook, a lot of fish, like, you know, but it's not gonna be fish. intricate. You, know? yeah. Yeah. you can entice a nigga to bite. Like fish, the fish are humans, right? In the same way you can entice a human to bite. If I like burgers and you put a burger spot at the corner, (laughs) (laughs) you feel me? Like there is, it is up to the fish, like it's up to the people, but it's a lot you could do to get the people there. Using a live bait is way better in a sense than using some fake shit. Five, three, no man. And it's like, why? Because you know. <laughs> you put a real you know, worm out there and a fake worm. But you don't You don't put that much. You don't, don't be put that much. Shit. No. You mm. just be out there. It just, it just slows me down. I think that'd be my issue. Like, if I'm out there with shit like that, I'd be wanting to be the best. Mm-hmm. Like, I can't nice just, fresh. I can't just, like, be out here. It's like, nah, nigga, I'm finna catch a honey, or we not going that <laughs> Nigga, we was out there, I was like, uh, uh, last one. How you you niggas ain't getting nothing. nothing. Yeah, Y'all so gonna go high. home with nothing. How so you gonna high. feed your family? Nigga, I was, <laughs> <laughs> nigga, I was so hot. They like, this nigga gonna cast again. Watch. I would rail up. Nigga, I ain't gonna get a fish, nigga. Nigga, I was so high. Like, how oh, we yeah. had to leave with nothing? Um, Not one. But it's like, see, it, it's got to be balanced because mm-hmm. sometimes you need to just be out there, but you need that spirit to ever bring mm-hmm. home a fish. Yeah. Like, What's that, I guess you could be okay. Like, it depends mm-hmm. on if you okay with not bringing home a fish or not. It's it's cause like when you do, it's so much like it's like <sighs> like it, all of it was worth it. Cause it's like I go out there barely catch any fish, but then one fish is like, especially if it's big. Mm. You just be patient, but you don't. So you don't do no extra to make sure you bring your fish home. Uh, I mean, using better baits, yeah. But it's like, I, I, I usually don't catch shit. <laughs> Damn. Fishing for the kind of fish we fish for too is like, it's a lot of that. Like growing up with my grandpa, that's why I would be like, nigga, in about an hour and not catch so shit. I'm looking around like, y'all niggas not ready to go. Cause it's like, nigga. What we doing? It's hot as fuck out here. I'm ready to catch a fit. Or let's move spot. Let's do something. Remember, I was like, I told you, I was like, at about 15 minutes. Nigga, after about 15 minutes of not catching that, I'll be like, where's the next spot? Because we got to look for some fish. We got to go. We can't just stay here. You know, and that, here. that's interesting. Because um, you, um, you have like an insane amount of hustle too. But yours is different. Like, but then again, though, because when you hoop and you play the game, you be hella competitive. So it is still there. I'm about to say, but it's like you have a, a calmer. Fishing, though, is not something fishing. that, yeah, it's not something that you could go out and be like, I know I'm going to be the greatest at this today. That's like, it's really up. But you know what's crazy? Your grandpa got trophies. He do. And he go out every day and think he's going to be the greatest that day. And some days, he don't catch shit on a boat and all. Yep. On a boat and all, oh, nigga go out on the whole boat. Oh, he get one bite out there too. It's like he's <laughs> yeah. mad, and I'm like, bro, we just caught something. He's like, you <laughs> call that a fish? Nigga, <laughs> 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 ain't no goddamn fish. <laughs> Only you could eat that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's hella funny. Cause that's funny you say that because my grandpa would always talk about that shit growing up as a kid. I used to think that's why he took me fishing was for life uh, lessons. Uh, Nigga, we ain't out here trying to catch up. We I catch a fish, but it's like, like he would instill in me like, yeah. you don't mm-hmm. you don't eat today if you don't catch it. I one time, bro, we was on it was a hot ass day. He handed me the water bottle. I couldn't for the life of me open that water bottle as a kid. This nigga looked at me and said, "Damn, if I wasn't here, you would just be assed out. Wouldn't have nobody to help you. You would just be fucked up in the, in the wilderness all by yourself. Couldn't get a water bottle open. You gonna die of dehydration? That nigga, you nigga, put it on hella thick. Nigga, I'm in the back like, <laughs> finally got it open. He was like, and that's why you gotta persevere and get through shit. Cause I ain't gonna be here to always help you. And I swear to God, bro, that shit was like crazy." To this day, we talk about that memory. Because it's yeah. like, I hated that nigga in that moment. You gonna really make me open this water bottle, nigga? I'm back here sweating. But I did. Yeah. You know, that nigga, um, he be dropping yeah, gems. For real. And he's like one of us. Like, he's comedic. Which is like, it's crazy that 
he be having to do with what he did because he comedic, like, nigga. <laughs> All day and night. Crazy. And then she not. She look you dead in your face like. That it's like polar day. opposites. It's my mom and my dad. Polar opposites, bro. Crazy. Like, don't know how they got together type shit. That's how opposite they are. Like, I don't know how he married them. I really don't. Why you do it? For the life of me, I don't get it. I feel like when you just moving in your life, you're not really no, you, you choosing. Like, you just kind of dealing with whatever comes your way sometimes. You feel me? Because you move so fast. But that's why you got to slow down. Mm-hmm. Fish. The socks say going fishing. <laughs> that came back full circle. Bruh, you, you, we have like proven, we're probably going to be the biggest group of like normal successful niggas that's existed in a very, very long time with an industry like we don't really see it no more. What do you mean by normal? Like a nigga who, that's like the same. <laughs> like you can walk down the street and see 10 of a nigga that look just like, it's like nigga, that reminds, you know, we were walking, we were like, that's child. <laughs> that's <laughs> like we're all, you see you reflected in the world. And it's not that you're not a star or nothing. It's, it's just like like a starlet or something. If not, it's cool. Cause I think uh, I just feel like once you start buying like million dollar cars and and, and kind of living for the NH, it's just like you you, you exited mm-hmm. your normalcy because it's like, bro, <laughs> it's not who you were. It's like what bro said the other day at Martinez when I was like, I walked in the kitchen, this nigga was doing the dishes. And I was like, nigga, because that was his normal life before all of this shit. Like, you were still doing that shit. You were going there when your mama would be like, right? Nigga, you, like, you forget, you start to get out of that, out of that box in that life. And it's like, you have to. But I only said that because it's like, nigga, that's your size. Like, this nigga, Young Thug, got a famous viral video of his maid finding 10 racks in his house from cleaning. Like he has a maid. Yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. But it's like it merits different levels of life. You know, yeah. it's like an everyday maid is different. And hey, maids are pretty affordable. But sometimes it's really? like them niggas you gone for weeks. Weeks at a time. <laughs> but exactly. Who the fuck in the house? Right. So dirty you know. enough. Who the fuck you doing? You're thinking that you're working every day. True. Who know how to make beats still? The kind of beat we need. We need some soul. Ain't that one. You got it, nigga. (laughs) (laughs) If something crazy happened. Yep, yep. Nigga. (laughs) Damn. Damn. (laughs) I don't know if you want to talk because I know you're going to Oh, Splash, you put a drum flash real quick. On the airplane, though. On the airplane, though. That's what you gotta do when they go. Oh, you better go. You better go shit, huh, bro? Yeah. On the the airplane. Yeah. Fucking hilarious. What's up? You know, it'd be so quiet in that hole. Nigga, now you gotta walk down. Nigga, I walk down like this. You better go shit, huh? Yeah. Nigga, like. We gotta get a nigga with that. You know how, like, there's phases in life where you feel like you can't be, like, human? Yeah, it's always like, a little. I, I hate walking on airplanes. I don't know why. It just be like, it's just such a weird yeah. experience, and everybody feels. That would work. Feel like, oh you feel like imagine you get on an airplane and niggas. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you feel you got some good music, some tunes to load in. Yeah, nigga. you do feel like when you get on an airplane. Soul plane, like nigga. Right? Like you're supposed to be like. But this should be soul plane. This should be like, nigga, we chilling, nigga. Probably because niggas getting on that motherfucking nervous for real. It's really, yeah. I don't get on there smiling. It's nothing to be funny about but it. They, they, don't, don't, they, they don't, don't help you with the experience of getting on their style. Like, it, it feels like a daunting task. You know? Like, yeah, nigga, yeah, make it yeah. enjoyable. It's all fine. It's all fine.
<laughs> I was calling his name yesterday. I'm like, I'll show it to you. Later. The, uh, <laughs> the, like, fucking Rick Ross. Huh? Uh, did you get that? Did you get that? Oh my god. I did not know that. That's good. I'm about to fly psycho. You back? Say what? So I'm going back to the can on Sunday. That's very short. I'm about to do the game. Hey. You like it out there? It's dope. Yeah, Karis moved back up here. Yeah. Really? Um, did she been on the school? Like, yeah, pretty much. We can set this Sorry. keyboard up here. Yeah, that would be that good. She's bugging me. She's trying to get in the lab. That could be on the desk. That's real clean, too. Mm-hmm. You're like, <laughs> You don't want to move my whole set up in situations that I got going on. Yeah. No. Crazy. <laughs> yo, yo, yo. It be your what own boat. Uh, 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 what's up, Harold? Yeah. <laughs> Did, you so on that? <laughs> huh? Did you want to record on that? Did you want to record on that? No, no, let's make something fresh. Okay. Oh, so oh, y'all hate fresh? <laughs> mm-hmm. Pretty much. Fresh Where am I food. supposed to go? No, you get to go right there. There's in. a couple other rooms. <laughs> 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 fresh. Oh, oh, my God. 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 Oh, my Toy. Play keys for real. Toy. <laughs> Alright, you, you play. You play. Y'all don't know. I gotta get you that keys at home. Okay. Let's hear a tune. Diamond when you running tightly Teachers ain't think I had the juice Cause I averaged the highest See I just couldn't 
him to play me. My soul knew where I was going. You can see, smell, feel the greatness punching and potent. Yeah. yeah, take you right to hell. Be cautious of where you going. Either jump off that cliff or spend life never knowing. That's a route. Yeah. Couldn't take all the bull I called. Called Jesus trying to work my faith. I always lean on God. Weird space. I can't even stay because niggas moving odd. From my medium and shift away. Yeah, I'm a deal just on a different day. I get the game and give the game and give my heart away. It hurts to start the book with friends and have to flip the page. Yeah. Supporting cast, move around a new season came. A shame. It's season three without my nigga. Season four gonna show you growth. Season five gonna make it bigger. Next one I have a toast. I write my own episode. Got directing and producing. Maybe he wrote before. That's why I always had the music. Yeah. I'm sick with a contagion. You could witness the influence. It's a bunch of them who don't, but a young nigga really do this. They just show you the blues. I come with the clues included and make it look impossible. Like I'm a friend of Rufus. I'm something like that horseshoe brand. How I'm the truth. I'm something like Adidas and Vans. How I'm a shoeing. I'm something like the brand with the swoosh. Just do it, nigga. Mm, I was 12 year old man. You can uh, take those arrangement parts from basically just like copy paste, copy paste. Sweet. Yeah. I'm gonna go get some sun. Then, if y'all wanna cook some, if y'all wanna come get some sun, then come back cook some. Yeah, I was gonna do that too. I'm gonna drink some the block. Yeah. That nigga Don was stumping hey, out bro. cockroaches as we were recording. I've never even seen him in there till that day. Bro. Nigga, they were <laughs> everywhere and they were big. That was his first impression flying, for me, too. Bro. They were not flying. Yes, they were. Nigga, and your girl was asleep. <laughs> she just went to sleep she on the couch. I was like, there's no <laughs> way. That time period, bro, we were going there like every fucking week. Whose studio nigga. was it? Uh, uh, Somewhere in Fairfield. Who's at the time? Are you going to stop us? Uh -uh. Off of North Texas? That nigga told me, he was like, man, this is like the best studio in town. <laughs> is yeah, it? Yeah, it was. <laughs> that shit was great. When she came in, hey, I went to sleep, came out nice I was though. like, she built different. <laughs> I was in there like this. And the speaker blew out. And the speaker blew out. Nigga said. Yeah, it did. It, it, it yep. did. The speaker blew out. <laughs> I think that was like only like the second or third session I'd ever been in with LaRussell, and I was just like. This is what the. Oh, no. Oh, that's crazy. Right, that's crazy. You know what's hella funny? Even where I am now, we still be ending up in those situations. Yep. Nigga, <laughs> we would be in the craziest place. <laughs> it's like, same shit. They got bugs. Same bugs, shit. Whatever. Hole in the wall. Nigga. Nigga, Virginia. Houston. <laughs> I was like, there's no fucking way. Nah, the studio in Virginia was fire. I'm not talking about the studio. Oh, this nigga. <laughs> God, we was in a banquet hall for yeah. sure. <laughs> nigga, did you ever go into the green room? No. That's it was just. <laughs> 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 it was just empty. <laughs> A big ass <laughs> empty room had though. I had the audacity the day before <laughs> to be girl. like, uh, yeah, what's on your guys' writer? I'm gonna make sure everything right for y'all. I done told that nigga jalapeno chips, Man, herbs. Yeah. Nah, <laughs> take this big <laughs> ass room. got the writer and said, hmm. <laughs> <laughs> take, take this big Ride ass that. room. <laughs> Ride that. <laughs> you shouldn't want anything. <laughs> I, I feel it though. I never knew a writer was a thing until I started knowing them saying, and it was like, nigga. 
Bring your own shit. That's what we be doing sometimes. We nigga. be bringing our own shit, but it still be like, yeah. damn, nigga. Hospitality. That shit didn't even have a chair. <laughs> It was, it, was just, it was just an empty room. It was like, <laughs> what the fuck? You know what's crazy? At larger venues, they charge you. Like, your rider comes out of your feet, and you don't really be knowing how much that shit costs. Oh, God. You said $300 for water. <laughs> Jalapeno <laughs> chips, water, and fruit, 300 <laughs> That's your rider. 300, 300. Don't question That's it. Your That's your rider fee. Don't question it. Don't even think twice. This is the only price we could get it for. This is the best we Matter of fact, it was $310. <laughs> we gave y'all a discount. <laughs> yeah, we do be in funny ass anyway. That's why niggas don't be letting people book them. They only <laughs> let businesses. And they only want to go through promoters right. and shit. You know, sometimes the only way to become a business is to be a person first, right? That's how we learn everything. I'm not gonna lie, the promoter bookings be worse than the people bookings. Sometimes, right? The people get you right. Then you ain't gotta, the, the, it just, yeah, it'd be, it be a little different. <laughs> Nigga, I hunted down Jason's partner at the rink show. And when I couldn't find him, I snatched Jason off the stage. Like, let me holler at you. Coach, right? I, yeah. Why? What happened? Because that guy that he brought to help brought like four Ooh, niggas backstage to get some water. Who the fuck he just bringing walked him into the green room and we were all in there laughing and then it got hella quiet. <laughs> that shit was funny though. Damn. I didn't even know Coach Rob brought anybody. <laughs> I was like, they can have water, but. <laughs> hey, in the middle of the show, I went to go get you some tea and the nigga was like, he won't throat coat, right? And I was like, what? <laughs> What? Oh, he <laughs> won't throw. No, but he said I didn't know what the fuck that was, and I'm just looking at this nigga like, are you being funny, <laughs> <laughs> nigga? What are you trying to say? You being funny right now? Oh, you got he won't throat coat. What? Oh. <laughs> what are you? What are you about to give my homie? <laughs> what do you mean? Throat, do he said that? throat coat extra honey. I was like, oh, wait, 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 wait. This is getting a little too, it's too much sugar in the tank. What's going on? What's going on? Why you say it like that? We should make our own throat coat. <laughs> yeah. Because it's like, we, we use that shit. It's like licorice. We should make our own honey. Baby. And like singers need it. We just need a tea that's like... If we market it as four parties, mm -hmm. niggas be drinking that shit thinking it's working. Right. <laughs> like the vocal drops. Oh, God. I, that's why I'm excited because I'm like, did that shit work? What? <laughs> what are vocal drops? Remember we took them with T Pain backstage? No. Nah. You sold me. It's free. <laughs> what was crazy is that they were like partnered with him. Yeah. He said it was him. Yeah. And he you said he was using on the whole tour. He didn't lose his voice. He didn't. He what also don't be screaming though. You literally will come out screaming. Yeah. Sure. Like sometimes when I watch the show back and he'd be in the crowd and he'd be like this. <laughs> 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 be like, <laughs> and that there is when he lost his voice. <laughs> what time is it? <laughs> I was, uh, I haven't talked to you guys since, like, before you guys even on the tour. It was cool. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
<laughs> nigga, I handle straight quicker. business. Two minutes. You Let's go. Quicker. Yeah, the warmer <laughs> Nigga. <laughs> I let her know too. <laughs> oh God, for that first one. I let her know too beforehand. Boy. I'm getting her done, just seeing it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Enough for me. I've been thinking about her all day. <laughs> hey, you slide down the slide. I'll wait at the bottom. <laughs> 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 wait. Hell no. <nah. laughs> and kid, kids will be like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and like a 30 year old nigga was on there swinging. Part of you would be like, what's up with this nigga? But the kid of you was like, duh, nigga, everybody love to swing. Right? Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. It's crazy. Weird. Uh oh, not the juicy teeth. Different. different. Oh, nice. Right up. This nigga on his merch run. Merch man. Need. 
succeed and like to succeed. Deliver broke men's dream, cars and cribs. Architectural digest to show how I live. Deliver broke men's dream, I live it well. It's hard to judge a life that I live as well. Deliver broke men's dream.
Can I hear the beat real quick? I'm laughing myself. <laughs> Leave me alone. Leave me alone. <laughs>